Welcome to another episode of the Sherlock's The Lost Case, The Lost Case Files, The Lost Files. I never remember the whole name of the cases, I think. The Lost Cases of Sherlock Holmes? Yeah. Yes. At, at least Sherlock Holmes uh, the um the old uh, flash game Sherlock Holmes. Go to the menu screen and see that we are playing Detective Epiderm. Lost, Lost cases. Cases of there. Sherlock Holmes. Yes. And then the, the beautiful animations of the weird looking yeah. horse. Yeah, but I also That's... just like my new music. Because this yeah, one's I mean, a different yeah, one. Can, yeah, we can listen to this one for a little bit. So. So, yeah, uh, we're the same people as uh, we've become accustomed to. Welcome to Stealthy Cookies, Spider Golem. There you go. Yes. Uh, we've been enjoying uh, finding stuff. I have been starting to get worse at the game, and Spider has been getting better at the game. Which we is complete fine. each other. We do complete <laughs> each other. I am 20%, she's 80%. Together, <laughs> we're 100%. Yeah, yeah I mean, it works. It's a, it's a very nice track. It's been... Um, it's... Um, it's nice to listen to, which in the previous episode I did miss. I said, like, hey, I missed listening to the music. Mm -hmm. It's part of, part of the reason I want to play again. Yeah, the music is awesome. Yeah. Which is surprising, considering, like... I mean, the production value for how old this game is and mm. Splash. It was it was more on par with the, with the time, but still, it was still jank, you know? Considering, if you look at what year was this, like, 97, 2000? This game. Yeah. 2008. 2008, okay, yeah. Yeah. So it, it's Jack. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's shit. But, you know, <laughs> it's uh, the music's so good. Or at least um, I'm pretty sure it's 2008. Eight. Anyways, it's not that, that important. Yeah. So, like... Yeah, it's a Flash game. What can you expect? There's only there's there were so mm. many limitations to what Flash could do, and uh, nowadays it doesn't even exist. Well, not not usually yeah. exist anymore. But yeah, we're doing a new mission, a case. Yes. We found a total of five cases. Yes. Now we're we find on episode four. Episode four. Yep. It's time for the Death Car Devil. When the great detective faces the supernatural, danger is in the cards. Ooh, do we get to see ghosts? Damn it. Miss Jackson, I understand that you're an American journalist and, uh, what was that again? A spook spoiler. I'm researching a New York <laughs> Times feature, one that shall expose the tricks and schemes that phony spiritualists use to exploit the public's fascination with the supernatural seances and phantoms and all that rubbish i have no interest in such things myself so why come to me two nights ago i was writing in my room up on the fourth floor of the whittington boarding house in russell square suddenly my window flew open and in leapt a short and devilish creature a ghost glowing in unearthly green and accompanied by a cloud of foul smoke indeed it leapt onto my writing desk snatched my manuscript and dropped a single tarot card the death card it then returned to the window and disappeared. Even though there's a four-floor drop to the cobblestones below. Might you've been dreaming? A woman with a writer's imagination. I was as alert as I am here before you. Not only did the experience frighten me, but the death card is obviously a threat of some sinister nature. <laughs> it sounds like some she sort of demonic visitation. Superstitious twaddle, isn't it? Old? <laughs> Mere superstition in this instance. Who or what is threatening you? And why, Miss Jackson? You said the Whittington board house, fourth floor, correct? Dr. Watson and I shall accompany you there. This is gonna be a small dwarf playing tricks on her or something. Yeah, I definitely wonder how suspects are going to work in this one. <laughs> yeah. It's just gonna be like a two meter tall guy. Yeah, he somehow made that happen. We don't ask questions. Yeah, I think the suspects are going to be interesting. Let's see what they <laughs> find out. But, um... I like that she was immediately convinced. 
being mm -hmm. part of I don't believe in anything. Must yeah. Very convincing. Yeah. Immediately goes, yep, yep, that that was a supernatural yep. occurrence. My, <laughs> my life is a lie now. Mm -hmm. Well, we didn't see it with our own eyes, so it might have been really convincing. Yeah. In the I like the believing in the I like the believing in the tarot card immediately though. It's like, mm -hmm. well, a deaf tarot card was there, so I think I'm going to die. So <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, yeah, little, little green de demon aside. Interpreting it as a death threat, sure, it makes sense. <laughs> yeah, a, a threat, yes. Yeah. But immediately as a, from being a crit, crit, critic of ghosts, spook spoilers. Yeah. Let's go to her room and look for ghosts. Mm -hmm. Yes, and demons. Are there demons there or here? No, take off the arrow glass, the magnifying glass, I mean. Oh, we start with the comparison immediately. Yes. Usually we do the find the thing first, don't we? Your death card warning, I see. Holmes, there are many such decks, each different from any others. It might be useful to discover which tarot deck originated this particular card. Mm. Observe, the bottom part of the card seems to be missing. Well. What bottom? I don't know. Oh, you're playing the game. Let me let me join yes. in. <laughs> Do you want to read her, or should I? I can take her. That was our invitation. Oh, she was a bit mm, snarky. There's an invitation to a sconce from my, one of our interview subjects, Mr. Gerald Mayles. He rents the room directly above mine. He owns an occult specialty shop near Covent Garden. An odd, mousy little man. <gasps> a mousy man? Maybe it's the demon man. Maybe. Do, 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 do. There is something oddly intriguing about this poster. Watson, let's have a closer look, shall we? Oh. Carswell. We need the to find great... 11 masks. 11 masks. Yes. Bora. Nope, that's a face. I'm playing the video games. Is this a yes. mask? I mean, this one? Yes. That was a weird one. Missing one. I'm missing one. Mm -hmm. I see it. Yes. You let me play the video games. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I've seen this fellow on the stage. A mediocre stage magician. Now moved on to the occult arts. I see. No doubt the pay is better. He ate a lemon. He became a <laughs> lemon. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the black rose. And there's two more black roses. Evil eyes? Oh, oh, those are. Wow, I thought those eyes were actually just like the mouse cursor. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, what happened to the face? <laughs> those evil eyes, blame Brother Stark, the half-crazed street preacher, who lives in the room beneath. Oh, God. he painted that evil eye during a visit two days ago. After he warned me against meddling in the black art, as he put it. Yeah, I thought those mm -hmm. random eyes were just like the examining curse or mm -hmm. whatever. Ooh, what's this? Claw marks. Claw marks. Oh. The creature was ghastly. It couldn't have been more than three feet tall and moved unlike any being I have ever seen. In my experience, it's not supernatural beings that leave behind luminous residue. Yes. He doesn't Shit know things. anything about supernatural beings, as he's already mentioned. Oh, yes. He doesn't care for them, but he might mm -hmm. read a bit story stuff. It's very believable stuff. 
A key. Mr. Spade, the landlord, gave me those keys when he changed my door lock. He would love nothing more than for me to write a sensational story about the encounter. He could then double the price of any room visited by the terrorizing devil beast. We need more roses. Yes. More roses. I like that one. You found a rose. Yes. I found a rose. A rose. Those black roses are an insubtle message from Mr. Thomas Latimer, one of London's most dashing yet impulsive journalists. He asked me to marry him. I refused. He did not take it well. Hmm. It's quite crunchy. Miss Jackson, that seance in the room above yours? This imitation says that you may bring guests to witness the great Coswell in person. What the great Sherlock Holmes and I do? Hmm. Did we find the hat? Or did we I, not find the pipe or? I think we missed something. Oh well. Oh no. Hopefully the hat is on the next one, but I feel like this might have been the hat. Oh shit, no! Yeah, we missed the hat. Dang it. Oh no! But... <sighs> no, but that does that ruin it? Yeah, I think that ruins it. Should we do it again? <laughs> sure. No. We Wait. can. We can do it again. So, exit, play... And... No! We, we need to we start a new... We start one of the previous ones. <gasps> can we skip? And... Then go back. So... Sure. What is his so, condition? Skip, skip. And menu. menu exit. Play. We can't let go of the hat. Yeah. Well, we need to be and pro gamers. Start. And. Miss Jackson. Skip. And yes. So. Quick speed run. Wait, the, the hat moved. The hat isn't there anymore. Dang it! Wait! They being tricked sneaky. us! Now I'm just looking for the hat. <laughs> um, Quick players, play I fast. Seen the hat yet? I wonder if the other, other things change as well. Well, I see a giant painting behind the sunflowers. That was the one I picked up earlier. Oh, fine. Fine, fine, that's this the poster. One. Okay. Yeah. Bingo, 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 points, points! Well, that's how you get more points. <laughs> points at bingo! Got you got a c -c 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 combo Oh, I found the pipe. Okay. Here. Ah. So I guess the hat is on the other one now. Maybe. Because I don't think they're on the same one. Maybe. Okay, now we just need to find the rest of the things. Yeah. <laughs> We're both so eager to press buttons now. Yes, buttons. What was the things you found? Uh, that. Yeah, death card. <laughs> uh. We had a key. That. Here. Yeah, the key. We skipped the dialogue. And no, we didn't. One black rose. Yeah, I took the one on the oven. This one. There's the one that you found. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. We got it. Easy. Yeah. Quick and easy. Back to where we were. So, ideally, this one. Yep. Yeah. Hat. Oh, there it is. <laughs> All right. Okay, I've done my to, job. <laughs> we're back to it now. Yes. Cane. Would this be a cane? Or that be a cane? That's a cane. I guess that's a cane. Banana and a banana peel. Or banana. Wow. And the peel. Yep. It appears that some sort of animal has been kept in here. What would a medium want with a caged creature? It's not a ghost. 
Well. Maybe it's a caged ghost. I see you have copies of your newspaper, Miss Jackson. Either the demon was real or it was an imposter with a purpose as yet unknown. But the third possibility presents itself. You fabricated the entire account in order to meet me. No doubt that your newspaper would pay well for an interview. Ah, I see. Yeah. Ah, new motive has appeared. Look at the poison. Look at this. This is scary. <laughs> poison. Drink it. Those handbags belong to... <laughs> That's the first. Lady Alice Porter, <laughs> wife of millionaire Sir Edmund Porter. She follows the great Carswell to all of his seances. Scissors top hat. Three bells. Three bells. Top hat found. Oh, there it was. <laughs> He's not bowling, by the way. The top hat and cane must belong to Carswell's royal advisee, Sir Edmund Porter. I hear Sir Edmund pays him handsomely for his spiritual guidance. Hook. And scissors. And then devil's heads. I guess these are devil's heads. Yeah. But how would you know exactly how the other devil's heads are? Yeah, okay. <laughs> no. no. Yeah. It's like hard to know exactly what they mean with devil's heads. Mm -hmm. I guess they were horns or something? I guess so. What's under the... Is that a spider, spider? Yes. Look, it's a friend. Yes, that's Tarantula. Very cute. Look, pick him up. I Take wish. him home with you. I actually want to have a Tarantula at some point. Yeah, that'd be cool. Found a bell. Ah, those are looking bells. I see the scissor. On the table. It will be helpful to examine the contents of this trash more carefully. Hey, that's not trash. It's my, it's my stuff. <laughs> Apparently someone was trying to destroy this tarot deck. Ooh. Place a piece of the tarot cards in the holder in the middle to match the three pieces of each card. Completed cards will be moved to the right side of the screen. Do you want to play? Or yes. I play? You play, okay. Uh, there. Mm. There, that's one of them. Your turn. I see we're doing this thing. I mean, it's fun. The devil. That way we both get to play. Haha! -ha. I like... So here's here's a hot take. Like, I don't believe in tarot card stuff, but mm -hmm. I do like the designs of the old traditional tarot card. Mm. I actually bought a traditional looking one. But I don't believe in them. But here's the thing, mm -hmm. also... Because I was treated to a session... Mm -hmm. um, one time. Mm -hmm. uh, that doesn't work there. Um, I'm thinking over here. Whoa, Empress. What am I doing? Strength? What is going on? Hmm. The Emperor. Hmm. There's one that says the Emperor. Oh, is there? It's oh, this one. Oh, I didn't see. But yeah, so the cool thing about it was that it, it actually... Um, like, the this idea about forcing out like um like what what could this mean i picked mm -hmm. out this card what do you think this could mean so mm -hmm. it's very good to to like suggest nope this is weird i don't i don't, I don't get it spider this is going mm -hmm. so it does kind of open the hell am I doing? <laughs> Open some um, ideas about um, 
things that you might think about uh, in relation to what the cards say. So it like opened avenues of thought, you know? Mm. So in that case, it was pretty cool. I am very good at this. Oh, wait, this is actually... Okay, so... Mm -hmm. There's lost pieces here. Yeah. Ah. So the bottom of the death card. The death card that the apparition left as a warning to you. May I see it, please? Hmm. Just as I suspected. This remaining piece matches perfectly. Well, Everything yeah, I've from never the scissor. really interacted with tarot cards. No, I, I had a friend who was just so into mm. it. And uh, we were hanging out a bit, and I said, like, yeah, sure. So mm. it was basically very nice for me to be able to, able to not believing in any of those witchy wizardry. Mm. Or like, oh, no, this card popped out. There must be some spirit talk mm. to me. Like, I don't care about that. But pick out whatever. And I can see if, like, I can make a connection, because it's mm. fun. Yeah. Nice bird. Yeah, I like that it's animated. Yeah, it just lives Very in here. Very few things, yeah. Like, they, they were just talking about how, like, why would she have a caged animal? Like, yeah, yeah. she has a raven right there. Mm. And she has a tarantula. <laughs> yeah, under the chair. Safe. So... I mean, sure, some people have their birds just roaming around yeah, the yeah. house, but... It's like, if you want to be able to open a window, then... You're either going to have to lock it in a different room or in a cage. So... Yeah. Assuming this one doesn't count, no. Stop a, clicking! Devil's head. <laughs> Am I distracting you? Oh, is this it? The devil's head? Oh, yep. yep. Yeah, there it is. Holmes, a glowing creature, foul smoke, and can leap to fourth floor windows. Perhaps this time we must accept that the supernatural being is authentic. Yes, good, Watson. This is a true ghost, and we believe mm -hmm. all of this. Yes. Especially since it's already very much a circus act or something. Mm -hmm. Of course we have to believe it. Yeah. So we're looking for a hook and a bell. And a bell. Is that to the left of the grappling on there, top there? Just a Where? little bit more left. Just oh, there, yeah. behind it? That? No. No, like this? No, what is this? No. No. What about here? <laughs> what is that? Nothing. Hmm. Yeah, um... I don't really know anyone who even has a tarot card deck. But I do have mm. two uh, boxes that are meant for tarot card decks. Ah, uh, okay. I just like pretty boxes. Yeah, that, that's why I bought the tarot uh, deck. I haven't even mm. used it yet. But I just, I bought the classical look because, as I said with mm. these, I just love the look of them. They're so medieval, yeah. you know? The one I have is like a puzzle box type thing, so oh, yeah. you have to slide a panel to the side to open it. And the other one is like in this style, but uh, it's designed to look like a uh, like stone tomb thing okay, with yeah. a dragon on top. That's cool. Yeah. Anything like dragons, you got me. Stuff and, you yeah. got my vote. No. Uh -huh. Like I just thought it looked so pretty. So. I remember, like, um, not that I was huge into writing or anything, or mm -hmm. 
like a fan of fantasy. I haven't mm -hmm. read a lot, or uh, compared to many other people, but it's like people saying, you gotta be original if you like to make some new stuff, and uh, you gotta think more creatively. But for me, it's like, I hear all that, but again, like, like, give me a dragon, and I'm like, build up a cool dragon to me, and I'm going to love it. I just, I just love it so much. The mm. idea of a big ass dragon. Yeah. Ah, oh, what are we missing? We can't find it. Spider. We are bot good. We can't solve this case. Yeah, it's difficult to know what the hook would look like. Yeah. No. Looked more like a spike than a hook, but still. I'm just trying to uh, look That's the hook. It. What? Oh. It was Good just job. hanging in the curtain. I see. Now so, it's one bell. Still got bell. one bell. Somewhere. Not behind the uh, cage or anything. Don't really see anything that looks like a bell. Yeah. Well, it's gigantic. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we've already found everything else, so we can use our one hint, technically. Yeah. I mean, in that case, it is just yes. one hint per scenario, because that's what we get. Yeah. I mean, we, we get six hints, technically, but... Yeah, but that's because we've been bossing. We no, get you one just extra get hint five automatically. Do. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, I see. And one extra one for finding the pipe. I see. But we basically only use our extra hint. <laughs> Unless, maybe with the painting one, we... Use two, hence that one. Yeah, I, I think we did, yeah. But yeah, I think it might be time for a hint, because... Let's do it. Let's do it. It's in the lower corner there. Wow. What the fuck are we looking at? Oh, like, it's on the... Oh, it's, it's it one of like those bells with a handle. Yeah. It looks like we're yeah. part of the chair. Mrs. Agatha R Raleigh always brings a bell to these things. She claims it attracts the spirits. Alright. We did it. Okay. And we found the hat. We did. You found the hat. Sherlock Camp found. Yay, yes. yay, 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 yay. Now you can play the funny game. Since sure. I got to play the funny game last time, you'll be able to play it now. All these suspects... So, <laughs> I love this straight face. Straight hair. You've got straight hair. Um, you've got straight hair. So, just and switching these two around. You've got a cape. You've got a cape. Bam. And handkerchief. You're so good. Magnificent. Yeah. Magnificent. Now that we've correctly... Come on, come on. So. Bell. Handbag. Newspaper. Top hat. Poster. Envelope. Um, key. Black rose. And the evil eye. Okay. Perfect. There we go. Perfect. 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 Yes. Yeah, I just love him saying this. Nice work. Who is it gonna be? Perfect. Who is it gonna <laughs> be? It's the street peach because he looks like a gnome or something. Yes. He looks like well, a demon. we'll see. Maybe the magician. Nice work. 
It's like a magician. magician because he he makes the cool tricks or something, or mm -hmm. it was just a lie. Who knows? We'll see how they unravel the case, huh? Yes. Good job, Spider. You did it. What would we do without you? <laughs> Probably take longer. I like that this looks like a thumbs up, a yellow small hand. Mm -hmm. They're like. <laughs> mm -hmm. To me, it kind of looks like a banana peel. <laughs> just that that's the best with a, such an extravagant suit and a banana yeah, peel a banana in the pocket. <laughs> that's just that would be lovely. I would love that. <laughs> the so called demon was in fact an assistant to the great Carswell. Oh I suspected an experienced stage magician when I saw the cunning compound of phosphorus that left glowing stains. And that foul smelling smoke is a common magician's trick to confound the viewer and obscure the trickery. After his friend Mr. Mails told Carswell about the expose Miss Jackson was writing, Carswell disguised his trained pet monkey, pet monkey. as a glowing devilish horror. He then sent it to a room to steal her manuscript and frighten her off the story. That was My a demon? article would reveal the tricks used by so-called mediums like Mr. Carswell, whose bank account has fattened considerably thanks to the likes of Lady Alice Porter and her millionaire husband. I saw Carswell's last stage show. In a desperate attempt to save his legitimate career, he had added a macaque to his act. Truly, it was hard to discern who was the master on stage, the magician or the monkey. But the monkey came through my fourth floor window. How did he ascend to such a height? He didn't. Carswell merely lowered the beast down on a rope attached to the hook above Mr. Mail's window. The odorous smoke helped hide its climb back up to the room above yours. <laughs> One more thing before we leave you, Miss Jackson. Here is your manuscript, complete and undamaged. I found it in Mr. Mail's room. I suggest you deliver it to your newspaper at the earliest opportunity. Congratulations. We did it. We're soon halfway. No, yes, we're not. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> soon, TM. We'll see if we actually if we actually end up doing all of these or not. It's fun. But like, yeah. the, it, it's fun, but we have a lot of ways to go. Yeah, but we've got time. Yeah. We've got time, unless accidents happen. <laughs> Maybe they'll have to get us, you know? Maybe the monkey. The yeah. Mechanic. Yeah, the monkey and its mask being lowered down from a window on a hook. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was scary. That was a demon. Yes. I was spooked. Yes, I'm shaking. Are you okay? I'm, I'm, you I'm so off? very scared. Do you need to break? Do you need to take a... We can end the video. If you need to yes. breathe. <laughs> but yeah, like... That was a very well-trained monkey. Yeah. I mean... Like, well, monkeys can do a lot. Yeah, but th training it to get the manuscript and leave the card and then climb back up. Leaving the card is uh, like, maybe a bit hard. Yeah. For, yeah. Like, th that's many steps. He's a magician, okay? <laughs> yeah. It's all magic. He just, mm -hmm. uh, he just, um, casts suggestion on the monkey. Yeah, it spell. just seems like too many tricks combined to, like, be able to teach an animal that fast. No, I believe it. <laughs> <laughs> like... For example, with movies and stuff, they have to know way in advance what the animal needs to be able to do and then train them. I know, I know, I know. So, in this case... Way to ruin the, the moment, animal, Spider. Everybody watching. The animal didn't even see the trainer. <laughs> so. No, no magic here. No monkey magic. <laughs> Only fake. Yes. Don't believe in anything. The two fairy, just an old man. Santa Claus, a fabrication of your identity. <laughs> so I made up Santa Claus. Yes. Hmm. And Jesus is just a book. Hmm. 
What? What's wrong with that? He's just a book. He's just in the book. <laughs> he is a book. He is a book. Hmm. Also, today's hot takes yes. when it comes to controversial topics. Jesus is a book. <laughs> Jesus is a book. He is a book. This is still a book. The second coming is still not a book. Um, okay, enough religion, Spider. Stop it. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> uh, thank you for watching another case being solved by the cleverest and the clever. Me and then Spider. <laughs> yes, you're the cleverest. Thank you. I didn't think you would admit it so quickly. <laughs> but yeah, it's true. So thank you so much for watching. Um, join us next time where we'll do a video. <laughs> Yeah. And you you can watch the games and stuff. Yes. Yeah, or Yeah, good. Okay. Mm. And <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Two words. Come and subscribe the like. <laughs> yes, come and subscribe <laughs> like. I learned that keywords gets the point across. <laughs> come and subscribe like. <laughs> yeah, bling, it's bling, also ring, just, ring. Yeah, it, it's not even the usual order, so it's <laughs> yes. all wrong. Yeah, but you know, if it's not the usual order, it makes people think that they actually do yes. it. Yes, yes. Are you are you thinking? Yeah, we did the thank you for you. But then again, yes. In all seriousness, if you like this video, please um, say so. And if you don't, um, yeah, just. Uh, Tell us what you think. We're still creating videos. We're having fun. And uh, if you guys aren't going to say anything, we're just going to keep on doing our thing. If you enjoy something uh, specifically or particularly, then say like, I want this video. And we might do it more. Or come back to something that we've forgotten about. So. Yeah. All critique comments and stuff like that helps us to, to evolve. That's a strong yeah. word. Well... It's a good word. It's a yeah, it's a good word. I like to think big. You mm. know. With that cleverest mind of mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you also just like to like, plan way ahead. Oh yeah. Definitely. Because evolution takes time. Yeah. You gotta set this foundation. Mm. I'll become a book soon, just like just like <laughs> Can I mean, leave you've got now? the looks. Can so. I leave? <laughs> but yeah, if you like the video, tell us. If you don't like the video, uh, tell your neighbor. Yes. <laughs> Ruffle his feather. <laughs> Just the one feather. And say, jip -ba -ba -ba! Okay. Yes. We're just mumbling. Thanks for watching. We're weird. Goodbye. Have a good day. Yes. See you. Bye.